Hello! How's it going? How do I sound? Decent? Oh yeah! So what is going on everybody? Um, thank you guys so much for being here at the start. I really appreciate that. Um, I got me, myself, a D&D &D Forgotten Adventure Realms booster box that I'm going to open for everybody. Uh, so, I guess let's just, uh, let's tear right in. Yeah, I, I knighted a few people. Uh, not a lot of knights going after today, though. Pull the bard. I hope so, man. That was so rad I got that in the pre-release. So, oh yeah, my camera. I'm going to do some delicate snips. I'll probably be doing way more delicate snaps. But, damn, every game is a new campaign. Yo, this set's so sweet. Uh, about myself. Yo, man, it's me. You guys all know who I am. No, I'm just teasing. Uh, so my name's Aaron. I'm uh, 33. I'm a disabled vet. I uh, chill at home play a lot of video games. Uh, I like IPAs. I got a motorcycle I barely ride. Uh, it's a lot of fun. So let's check this out real quick. Let me get you a little better angle or back it up rather. Check those suckers out. Look at that. Other than that beam of light. Oh, I could go up a little more. Look at that. Beautiful. What about you guys? What are you up to? I can chat with my phone and figure out how to do it. Bam, look at that. Oh, right on, man. Hope work was good. Jeez, oh, pizza. Look at these cards, man. What do we got? Let's see. Thirty cards? Thirty packs of cards, guys. Let's get this sweet looking box out the way. Whoa. The Raichu emote. I thought that was a Pikachu emote. Whoa. Look at these babies. Alright. So there is a card that I'm hoping to get. There is an artist signature, or signing rather, that's taken uh, taken place down in Utica, the Steampunk's Tap Room. Um, Shrek box confirmed. Uh, so I'm hoping to pull some Philstone art cards. Uh, there's a rare that I saw. There's a common. He only did eight cards for this set, um, but I just think it'd be really neat to go meet him, uh, get a few cards signed by him. And hopefully, uh, you know, I can share that with you guys if I can get them signed. Uh, so I'm going to fix the angles one more time, and then we should be good. Uh, I'm going to tear into these cards. Look at that, delicate snips. That's all you need. Oh, God, what a terrible open. I'm so bad, guys. No delicate snips. Alright, anyway, let's check these babies out. We got a goblin, and I believe the dungeons, uh, which are a new mechanic. Uh, I think I've talked to you guys about them before, but essentially it's called Venture into the Dungeon. You get to choose between three dungeons, uh, and they have kind of different effects on them as you play the cards. Uh, so we'll talk about that. But, check it out. Got an art card. Whoa, little owlbear sneaking in there. Oh, hey, look at that. It's kind of rad. So. Huh. Alright. So, this is an alternate art. I believe it's called a showcase uh, art. Um, but this is the same art style that Phil Stone did. This is what I'm looking for. Um, but, let's keep rolling here. Planar Ally. 
What? Fates Reversal, Clattering Skeletons, uh, Hulking Bugbear, uh, Tribe Hunter, Hunter's Mark, uh, Kalyan Reclusive Painter, the old Black Dragon, uh, Lair of the Hydra. If you control two or more other lands, Lair Hydra enters the battlefield tapped. Uh, tap to add one green or X and a green. Until the end of turn, Layer Hydra becomes an XX green Hydra creature. It is still a land, and X cannot be zero. So, whoa bam. Hey, potion of healing. Alrighty. Well, let's just keep rolling, I guess. We got a lot of these, man. What if I delicate snips all the way through instead of uh, that terrible version we did last time? That's not even delicate snips. It's kind of all over the place. Look at that. Ugh. Sloppy cut. But as long as we don't hit a card, I guess it doesn't matter. Zoom out. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. I forgot. Oh, yeah. Is that better? Manic snips. Let's check out this art card. Oh, Red Dragon. Bam. Hey, thank you, camera. Appreciate that. Got a holographic forest. Ho, oh, Blue Dragon. Alt art, but it's not the rare. But still, it's pretty rad art going on there. Um, I think he's got... Yeah, he's got Lightning Breath. The other one was a Draw Dragon. That one's a rare... Um, Paladin Shield, 50 feet of rope. You can never go wrong with 50 feet of rope. Let's see. Is there a way I can, like, scoot that? Hey, look, more of me. All right. Uh, Borrowing of Clan Under. Compel Duel. Magic Missile. Hey, look at that. Planeswalker, baby. Eliwick Tumblestrum. He's a legendary planeswalker. Man, that's some tiny text going on there. Venture into the dungeon for plus one. Uh, for minus two, look at the top six cards of your library. You may reveal a creature card from among them. Put it into your hand. If it's a legendary, you gain three life. Put the rest in your bottom of the library in any order. And for his negative seven ability, you get an emblem with creatures you control, have trample and haste, and get plus two, plus two for each different named dungeon you've completed. So, man... Check that out. Definitely looking like a bard right there, here. Look at that. Nice planeswalker. What was that, second pack? Pretty good. Pretty good. Well, Ryan also hooked me up. Uh, we went out, got some sleeves and some top loaders, and since it's a planeswalker and they're generally valuable, I'm just going to go ahead and top loader this baby. Yeah. Bam. Look at that. Very cool. I'm excited. I hope all of them go that way. Here, I'll throw her up in the front. Oh, yeah. And then, for the rest of my pack, we got an Arcane Investigator Hollow, and then a Necrotic Sliver. Different set. Uh, I think they just throw a random card at the end of that. Um... Oh, no, Finn, your first pack was crazy, bro. What'd you get, like, four rares in there? Duh, that's crazy. Still hoping for that, uh, Phil Stone. Yo, check out this kobold. Wait, he's got five HP, bro. Hey, Johnny D, thank you so much, man. What's going on, bro? How's work? We got a mountain. Yo, alternate art. Got that Neverwinter Dryad. Let's see. Yo, plus two mace. Check it out. You get plus two, plus two. Uh, Dwarf Hold Champion. And we got some leather armor. Staple for any adventurer. Dungeon Crawler. And there's a battlefield tapped. When you complete a dungeon, you may return Dungeon Crawler from your graveyard to your hand. It's not bad. 2-1 one for 1. 
Uh, Death Priest. Skeletons, Vampires, Zombies get plus one, plus one. At the beginning of your end step, if something died this turn, pay one, get a Skeleton. A 1-1 one, one Black Skeleton. So that's pretty rad. I really enjoy that card. Power Word Kill. Uh, Arcane Investigator. What? Hey, man. $3 raise. Holy crow. You can't beat that. Bam. Loyal Warhound. It is a Doge. And it's got Vigilance. It's a 3-1. When Loyal Warhound enters the battlefield, if an opponent controls more lands than you, search your library for a basic planes card, put in the battlefield tap, then shuffle. It's not bad for turn two, especially if you're going up against some ramps. Oh, I'll get you a little better art view there. Um, he's pretty good. Hey, holographic beholder. Not a rare, but still looking cool. Hey, a Chroma's Memorial. It's pretty rad. Nice offset rare right there. Not bad at all. Whoa. Oh. Man, Ryan, you make it look so easy, bro. So easy. It's got to be. Got to be the scissors. Yo, Goblin. Check them out, baby. I guess I could go down a little more. Zoop. Whoa, bear with me for the tiny earthquake. All right. Bam. Check her out. Yo, more bards, bro. Bards up in here. Oh, uh, yes, I would like legit scissors, bro. That'd be rad. But no bard card yet for Ryan. I'm hoping we get the bard card. Got a bugbear. Is that a Phil Stone? Nope, no Phil Stone. Uh, Boria Pegasus. Plummet. Kill something with flying. Flying sucks, bro. Uh, Ranger's Longbow. Get some reach going. Uh, Caredale of Boulder's Gate. Uh, check for traps. Hugbear. Hey, DoorDash. Thanks, brother. I really appreciate that. What's going on, man? Uh, we got a portable hole. Uh, Yan T. Fangblade. Hey, what's up, man? Yeah. Thank you for some real life skizzers. I'm here, too. Oh, snap. <laughs> Streamception, baby. <laughs> Have fun, man. Thank you. All right. Oh, look at that. Drizzit Odurden. Look at that. I knew I was getting this guy. I'm not a huge fan, but the card in itself is pretty good. Uh, we got Double Strike. It's a 3-3. Uh, when he enters the battlefield, create his legendary 4-1 green cat creature token with Trample. Uh, whenever a creature dies, if it had a power greater than his, put a number of plus one plus one counters on it equal to that difference. So, bam. Hey, man. Thanks. I appreciate it. Yo, look at this purple worm. Hollow, alt art. Let it be Phil Stone. Just kidding, it's not Phil Stone. Ouch. But still, really cool. I can't can't tell you guys enough about how much I love this new artwork. I think it was called Showcase. I think that's what Ryan said. Oh man, real scissors instead of multi-tool scissors? Crushing the game. You're right, Keith. An Alaskan bullworm. Watch out! Bam. Flame Skull. Oh, got the same artwork right on the back. I'm loving that. Oh, sorry about that. There we go. Super trippy. Whoa. Making cheesecake. What's up, Tipsy? Thank you for hanging out. I really appreciate that. What? Hey, Owlbear. We saw him earlier. Let's see. Got Ranger, Spoils of the Hunt, Hoarding Ogre, Bag of Holding. Hey, Tipsy, thank you so much for the follow, man. I appreciate that. Uh, we got a Russ Monster, Genius Smith, uh, Steadfast Paladin, uh, 
Jarrett's Fireball. Hey, look at that. Alt Art. Old Jawbone. Mythic Rare Dragon. Never a creature you control deals combat damage to a player. Create that many treasure tokens. Holy crap. Wow. That's pretty rad. And I already pulled the, uh, the Tiamat card. Not in this box, but uh, I bought some pre-release boxes. Uh, me and Finn did. Me and Soul. And, uh... I ended up pulling Tiamat, Holographic Wish, but man, check that baby out. That's awesome. Set that down, throw that into the top loader. Totally lost? No way, man. We just got this rad dragon. Kicking butt. Swiss Cheesecake. Man. That sounds good. Oh, God. Fermunda Cake sounds terrifying. Uh, oh yeah, I was gonna top load of that baby. That's what we were doing. Weak? Are you kidding me, man? No way. Hey, get in there. Please? Hey, thank you. Bam. You didn't think I sucks? I think that's pretty good. Pop. All right. Got some sweet cards. Let's keep them moving. Can't see the full card. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah. I'll grab it. So that would be kind of the full art of them up there. Oh yeah. Whoa, don't fall, bro. Chill. All right, next pack. Yeah, I do love the different artwork, man. It's really fun. Um, uh, Zeriel, Zariel, nice little emblem. What else we got going on? These sweet art cards, man. I'm telling you. Look at that. The D&D themes just blow my mind. Alrighty. We got a forest. Frost giant. See, uh, no stones yet, man. We're looking for a stone. Great axe. Army vet. Boots of speed. Uh, Sharessa Death's Whisperer, you know, Warlocks, Eldritch Blast, that's all you do. Just tease him, but it's pretty good. Uh, Raven Feeblement. Pretty sure that's like 1d6 strength damage. No, I'm just kidding, that card doesn't do it. The spell does. Uh, Trickster Talisman, yo, Treasure Vault. Double X and tap, sacrifice, Treasure uh, Vault, create X Treasure Tokens. So, not too bad, kind of goes well with that green dragon we just opened. So, um, is it Ravnica? Favorite D and D canon character, Bartimo. You bet, he's my favorite too, man. I gotta get one of these Phil Stones, you guys. That's all I want. I can't believe Finn got two. Bam, let's check out this art. Hey, look at that. That looks super cool. Yeah, he's a double stone. No artist yet, man. I'm looking. I'm hoping. We'll get one, man. I got a lot of cards to go through. Dijon Windseer, Earth Call, Brazen, Swarming Goblins, got some Plate Armor, Battle Hammer, Choose Your Weapon, Troll, look at that, Zalto, Fire Giant Duke, he's a Giant Barbarian, he's got Trample, whenever Zalto, Fire Giant Duke is dealt damage, venture into the dungeon, looks kind of rad. 
McFarlane dragon figures. Hey, look at that. Another rare. Check it out. The Hand of Vecna. I got double rares in that pack. Uh, at the beginning of combat, on your turn, equip creature or a creature you control named Vecna. Ooh, that sounds cool. Gets XX until the end of turn, where X is the number of cards in your hand. Equip, pay one life for each card in your hand. Ooh. Uh, so, the dungeon mechanic, I'll show you in a moment. Um, do I have one of those chilling around? I did at the beginning. Where's my goblin? Hey! So, this is your, let me just, is that in focus? So, let me move it out of my name. So this is a dungeon. So like, for example, it says delve into the dungeon, or venture into the dungeon. When you venture, you get uh, to do one of three things according to the dungeon. This one in front of you is the Mad Mage. And so if you ventured into the dungeon for the first time, you'd gain one life. And then obviously you'd proceed through the dungeon um, up until you completed it to get the final objective. And then there are also cards in the game that say if you've completed a dungeon, if you've made it to the last step, then you uh, you get an extra bonus. They make it double strike or maybe plus two plus two. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, man. There's so many good stuff. Uh, uh, so so many good D&D &D throwbacks in this uh, box. I'm loving it. Roll, baby. More packs, man. So many packs. Brian was right, man. My back's gonna hurt after a minute. I think the cool thing about getting a box is, in addition to, you know, getting kind of back into Magic the Gathering, it, it just reminds me of a lot of memories. Like, I'm looking at that dragon card, and I'm not thinking about its text or whatever. I'm thinking about when I fought a green dragon. Like that, oh man, that was so rad. I remember this, I remember that. So it's just a lot of cool callbacks, in my opinion. Um, hey. Wait, what? Alright, anyway. Check out this full art. It's pretty rad. So. Got an island. Uh, the reclusive painter. That's the alt art. We've seen this before, but not an alternate art. Um, that's pretty cool. Uh, Dueling Rapier, Hobgoblin Captive, Goblin Javaneer, Monk of the Open Hand, Rally Maneuvers, Roper, Neverwinter Dryad, Pair of Goblins. Yo! Oh my god. This is sick, dude. Um, box Retails, I, I bought him for free when I traded my cards. Um, so Alt Art, Minion of the Mighty. I'll come back to you, Eric. I'm sorry. Or Q. I'm sorry. Um... Whenever he attacks, if you attacked with six or more uh, power, you can put a dragon creature card from your hand into the battlefield, tapped and attacking. Um, and this is the alt art, too. So not only is it a great one-drop uh, to just kind of hang out and piss your opponent off, uh, you get to play free cards. Uh, it's, it's dope. And you get free dragons. Goes right in the uh, right in the Tiamat slot. Throw him in there, get Tiamat out for free. Uh, yes, please. Or any dragon you want for free. Uh, that's rad. So I'm going to set him to the side. Uh, he definitely gets a loader. It's a very rare card. Secret layer. Look at that. I thought, I thought they put something in there backwards. I was like, oh no. He's made of toenails. Ugh. Now when I look at him the second time after I sleeve him, I want to think about toenails. And we're going to see... All right, ladies and gentlemen, made out of toenails. Hey, wait a minute. You're not wrong. They're clean toenails. <laughs> so, Rad, got a minion of the mighty. We're still chasing that stone, but we got a lot of really cool cards. Um... I'm really loving these Altar cards. That That's really where it's at. Alright. Let's keep rolling on through. Let's keep roping on through with a roper. Look at that. Look, fight that guy. That guy is creepy. He'll get you. 
All right, anyway. So we got a planes. Yo, clattering skeletons. Phil Stone. That's what I'm talking about. Phil Stone. Just showing you the bottom at first. So you know it's his. Clattering skeletons. I'll be showing him this tomorrow. We got him, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Special one on the side. All right. Let's go. Uh, so we got uh, Valor Stinger. Let's see. Ambushed on the road. Vampire Spawn. Chalrasara Moon Dancer. Say that three times fast. That was tough. I'm surprised I did that on the first take. Uh, cleric class. We got Moon Blessed Cleric. Duel and Rapier. Harma Pashar Ruin Seeker. Uh, Zorn. Look at this baby. If you were to create one or more treasure tokens, instead create those tokens plus an additional treasure token. Well, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What about this dude then? What if these guys are hanging out together? You'll have all the treasures. Just infinite tokens of mana. That, that's pretty, pretty crazy. All right. Get rid of that guy. We'll throw Zorn out of here. Eyes of the Beholder. Holofoil. Looking nice. Cool art. Hey, look at that. Beholder boy. Spoderman. So, how's everybody's Friday? Got a couple people coming home from work. Hopefully that went good. John's tearing it up today, so... Christmas tree deck? You know it. Get some more art going. That's so cool you get one of these in every pack, man. I swear. What's that? The Many Hand Monk, I think. Alrighty. We got a swamp. Yo, Black Dragon, alt art. I'm loving them, dude. I'm absolutely loving them. Thinking we make a dragon deck with all the dragons I've been pulling. I got Tiamat. Not... Technically not in this box, but I got a TMI. Contact other plane. Hey, Black Dragon. Look at that. So, like, even the artwork is... I like that I can do this side-by-side side real quick. Even the artwork is just really, really cool. Same card, but... Just so much better. Yeah, duo black, and then I do different arts. So it's the same card, you know, both four fours. But just to say how much I love those all arts, man. They're, they're really cool. You got two different versions in this set too, which is nice. All right, let's get back to it though. We got a white dragon. Look at that whole dragon. There's a dragon pack, guys. That's all it's in here. Oh, we got a human monk. But he's a dragon disciple. It's themed, man. Hopefully we get something good. Trich Willow, there we go. Non-dragon, non-dragon. Feywild Trickster. Yo, Ryan! There you go, buddy. This one's for you. You wanted it. Hey, hey. Show him his card, camera. Check it out, bro. Just for you. <laughs> Herald of Hadar. And then an extra. Yo, I'm putting that bard over to the side, though, man. Let's go, baby! That's gotta be an emote, man. It's gonna be rad. Alright. Yo, Zorn is that same dude we saw earlier. This is his monster stuff from Dungeons & Dragons. Do we get any cool artwork with, with Zorn? Oh, we do. We do. Oh, holding it the wrong way again. Look at that guy. He's just showering himself in gold, baby. That's the treasure decks. Super Beard Joe emote. That'd be sick. Oh, Hollowfoil Swamp. Underdark Basilisk. No stone. But we got one already, so I'm liking it. Come to a Knoll Camp. Demogorgon's Clutches. Divine Smite. Yo, Driders. Elf Spiders. No thank you. Uh, polymorph, 
Underdark Basilisks. Get the, there we go. Yo, a monk! Check it out! Second spell you cast each turn costs one less. If you pay two again, return up to one target non-land permanent to its owner's hand. Pay three. At the beginning of your upkeep, exile the top card of your library. For as long as it's exiled, you can cast this card in exile as long as you've cast a second spell. So, all about that second attack. Yo! Holy shit! Ho! Holy shit! Hang on! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, look at that. They're sticking to me. I'm all sweaty. I'm nervous. Mom's spaghetti. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get in this sleeve, bro. Just chill. Chill in the sleeve. Yo. We were talking dragons today, boys. And uh, we got some here. We definitely got some. Look at that, dude. Oh my god. Where's Joe? Joe better be on, bro. I'm gonna be sad. Look at that. Oh, I got both sets of Tiamat now. 40 bucks? Dang. Top value box, bro. Look at that. That is so cool. Mythic Rare, Hollow Foil, looking hot, and all art. Jeez. Crushing it, man. And it's a theme, man. We've been seeing all the dragons. We got old Jawbone. Hopefully we get more dragons, man. That's all I'm looking for. I, I have no idea. I'm just really glad. Like I said, you know, the D&D the &D callbacks are crazy. Look at that Tiamat. I, I don't even care. I'm, gonna get, I'm bringing it back out. Look at this. Wow, man. It's it's just sick. Uh, so anyway, it costs one of everything and two colorless. It's a uh, legendary dragon god. It's flying, and when Tiamat enters the battlefield, if you cast it, search your library for up to five dragon cards not named Tiamat that each have different names, reveal them, and then put them into your hand, and then shuffle. Then you just hit with the kobold. Throw the dragons in for free. I'm bringing you a thing. Thank you. I appreciate the thing. Wow. I was talking all big about the monk class, man. We got freaking Tiamat, bro. That's crazy. That. Wow. You gotta give my man an easel. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah for yeah. sure. Thank you, man. Yeah. Oh, bro. Yo, that was sick. We were just talking about that we card. Were, we were. <laughs> we were. Like, man, that's the best card. Now we got it. Yo. Yo. Check them out. That's dope. Thanks for bringing me that. That's a diesel. Diesel weasel. I'm just kidding. Don't don't copyright strike me. Damn. That that's really cool. Uh awesome. All right, let's keep rolling, baby. Jeez, oh pizza! How nuts! Gotta stop to stand. Whew. That was wow. That's so grand. All right, let's keep rolling, man. We'll get some other good pulls. We just got started. We gotta make Finn mad. Yo, these art cards, bro. I'm addicted. I think I'm going to uh, try and piece them all together. Maybe make a background or something. I think that'd be cool. Hollow Forest. Hey, check it out. So another alternate art card. These are lands, but they're made to look like D&D uh, &D character module adventures. Um, so this is ripped like straight off of the book. Uh, John made a comparison one time. It looked like it was a book. Um, they're rad, man. Uh, Pixie Guide, Dijin Windseer, Arcane Investigator, Temple of the Dragon Queen. Yeah, we live there. We live there. We got a lot of good dragon boys today. Look, look, green dragon. I'm telling you guys. Dragon Bard. Look, dragon theme, baby. Bar the Gate. A Mimic. Yo, everybody's best friend right here. I can't believe I pulled that team out. That card is ridiculous. Yo, Circle of Dreams Druid. 
Mana for each creature you control. Not bad, man. Good mana ramp. Ooh, Ranger's Longbow. Tomb of Annihilation. What's up? Demon. This is rad, you guys. Uh, dude, I can't believe I pulled that team out either. Like, we were just joking about it. We were like, oh, that's going to be the best card. Better build a deck around. I pulled two Tiamats. You are correct. I pulled the Full Art Hollow and the regular one. Oh, boy. Yeah, don't do that till I figure out how to fix those. Damn. It was like John cena -ception. But, hey, at least they work. Did it play like a hundred times? Did it sound as terrible to me as it did for you guys? Chit, 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 chit. Oh, for me it came in like a hundred times. Maybe it was just like my audio or something, but... Oh, okay, good. I, I thought it sounded horrible. Yeah. But hey, my sound alert works. Don't play them, please. They suck. Uh, check out this druid, though. Don't think about my shitty sound alerts. All right, we got an island. Yo, Manticore, that alt art again. Loving it. No fills, though. Uh, soul knife. Ah, yeah, yeah. You're not wrong. Uh, beep, beep, beep. Trepid Outlander. Pair of goblins. Owlbear. Ranger's Hawk. Uh, hey, Evan Death. Draco Lich. You know that guy, Finn. Oh, yeah, no, that sounded terrible. Hey, Dwarfold Champion. And a random card. What? Breaking Bad. No, I'm just kidding. Man, we're getting a ton of dragons. I mean, it's, you know, Dungeons and Dragons, but. Wow. I can't believe that we pulled that team up. Uh, Jesus, man. Hey, Spoderman. A Demi Lich. Alright, well, let's get rid of Spoderman first. Demi Lich. We got Plains. Hey, Purple Worm. Shortcut, Yon T, Thieves Tools, Battlecry Goblin, Morning Star, The Hugging Bugbear, uh, Valor Stinger, No Hunter, hey Meteor Swarm, I got this as a promo card. Hey, ah, uh, Secret Door, still pretty rad. Man, dude, that Tiamat. Well, what's going on, dudes? How is everybody? I know I've said that multiple times, but, you know, it's been a minute. Whatcha? Hey, mountain. Hey, another Phil Stone, Clatter and Skeletons. Maybe I get a playset. Loving it. New Joe emotes. Nice. Open your pack. I, dude, I'm telling you. They're fun. Look at that mimic. It's my boy. Oh. Hey, I'm just happy to get more of them, man. More dragons, man. Russ monster. Hey, Volo. Guide to monsters. Human Wizard, whenever you cast a creature spell that doesn't share a creature type with a creature you control or a creature card in your graveyard, copy that. Damn. No, the decks in this set are going to be sick, man. Compelled to duel. Invisibility M15. Look at that. They got to be throwing a random card in here, I swear. Finn was seeing them all day. I've seen a few of them. M15. It's pretty cool. 
I'm liking it. You get to kind of see what things used to be. So how do I fix that sound bite clip, guys? What do I do for that? I mean, I'll just turn them off, but... Which am? Hey, you magic missile art. That's pretty cool. Oh, headset. Right on. Uh, Porter. Grim Bounty. Devour of Intellect. Ghast. Purple Worm. Dungeon Map. Red Dragon. Zombie Ogre. Yan T. Mailson. Look at that. We got a rare pretty early in there. Every deals combat damage to a player. Venture. Can't be blocked as long as it's attacking by himself. Yo, long rest. Return X cards with different mana values from your graveyard to your hand. If eight or more cards were returned to your hand this way, your life total becomes equal to your starting life total. Oh. That's pretty cool. Oh, no, no quad rares. Yo, what? No way. Yo. Yo, somebody look up Urza's Blueprints real quick. What in the world? Dude, that's such an old set. Yo. Somebody. It might be worth five bucks. I don't care. Hey! Urza's Blueprints, bro, in my D&D &D pack! What's up, Joe? You missed a big boy open earlier, bro. I'll show it to you. But this Urza's Blueprints, I don't know what it's worth, but it's a nice older card. Uh, check this baby out, Joe. Shabam. Oh, all right, 50 cents. I'm down with that, but... I got frickin' alt art Tiamat and it's hollow foil. It's dope, bro. Yeah. I've been I've been pulling some cool stuff today. Um What? I got uh old gnawbone. Uh pulled that earlier. I kept it. It's the dragon for treasure tokens. Um, got Minion of the Mighty, Alt Art, so that's pretty rad too. Toenail Guy, as, as he's now known. Toenail Minion. Uh, then I got Eliwick, uh, which is the Green Planeswalker. Uh, so we got some pretty decent pulls, man. Yeah, I mean, we still got a lot to go. Man, I thought that Urza was going to be worth a ton. All right, anyway. So, did we do these? Fetch your ghoul. Yeah, long rest and Yam Melson. Yep, yep, yep. Just kidding, boys. How many packs have I gone? Well, if you got 30, I'm looking at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 15 packs left. So, we're about halfway there. For about an hour. Uh, I don't know. Let's see. Well, that sucks, man. I thought that Urza's Blueprint was going to be worth a ton. I guess it's just those gemstones that are worth a ton. I don't know. I got excited. I saw an old magic card. Just kind of go there. Uh, I did. I pulled a bard class for Ryan. It was pretty fun. Yo, look at that ooze art, bro. That's so cool. That ooze art's dope. Like right out of the monster manual. Go ahead and grab that gold, bro. Alrighty, let's keep rolling. Uh, we got a swamp. Uh, what, Gretchen Twitch Willow? Deadly Dispute, Spectre Ghoul, Price of Loyalty, Ray of Frost. Uh, 
Argnar? Yeah. Lonesome Troll. Clever Conjurer. Find the path. Yo, check it out. Phil Stone, rare, alt, art. What is up? Take that, Finn. I don't have to steal your cards. We got the same cards. Kick him butt. Awesome. Here's a Tiamat art card that goes for a signature gold stamp that goes for 15. Hmm. Oh, the art card. Just the art. Ah. Unexpected windfall. And a different card. But check it out, man. We got that Phil Stone, baby. Steal his cards anyway. I might. I'm going to try. So, yeah, man. I'm excited. So the real question I got to ask everybody is, do I have him sign the back of the card? Do I have him sign the front of the card? Do I have him sign the plastic container? What would you guys do if you were going to go meet an artist and he was going to sign your card? How would you guys go about kind of doing something like that? Then the plastic's worth the money, not the card. Custom draw on the front, directly sign. Right on the face. Perfect spot for it. I agree, man. Like, add to the art on the front. Oh, that'd be pretty rad. So we got a manticore with probably some manticore art for sure. Say the front. That's what I was thinking. All right, we got an island, cloister gargoyle. No fills, but we got we got our we got our cards, man. We're kicking butt. Half elf monk, cursed idol, reaper's talisman, a lightfoot rogue, trickster's talisman, horde robber, rave frost, vorpal sword. Yo, this thing's rad. Costs one mana to put out. Um, but equipped creature gets plus two plus zero and has death touch. What's that? Eight mana, uh, five colorless, three swamp. Until the end of turn, Vorpal Sword gains whenever equipped creature deals combat damage to a player, that player loses the game. You're done. You're, you're all, you're all done. You lose. The end. Uh, and then there's a couple cards that actually let you remove the uh, the equip cost, so sometimes you might not have to pay the two. But, yeah. Vorpal Sword's pretty rad. Hey! Hollow Foil Shepherd and a secret rare card. Or a secret lair. There's no secret rares here. This isn't Ryan's stuff. They're just regular rares here. Secret rares would be pretty cool to add to MTG, though. It'd make the game unstable and crazy, but, you know... Be pretty cool. I'd like it. Hey, let's check it out. Some more art. Look at that. Look at that tiefling. Nope. Bam. Not bad. Hollow planes. Yo, pixie guide. It's no stone though. Silver raven. Plundered barbarian. Um, secret rares are like out of the numbers though so like if you look down at the bottom if it can ever focus well either way down at the bottom it says like 58 out of 281 it just means like if you uh, if you got like a 382 card you know something that's not in print um, I, get, I think that's how the secret rares work for Pokemon I've, I've Ryan will post it up there. I bet you any money. Uh, Roper. Hey, Guardian of Faith. Flash. When he enters the battlefield, any number of other target creatures you control phase out. Yo! Check it out. More Morden Kanan. Nice, dude. 
That is crazy. Plus two, draw two cards, then put a card from your hand on the bottom of your library. Minus two, create a blue dog illusion creature token with this creature's power and toughness are each equal to twice the number of cards in your hand. That goes really well with Vecna. Um, exchange your hand and library. What? Whoa, what? Minus ten. Exchange your hand and library, then shuffle. You get an emblem with you have no maximum hand size. Wow. Hey, hey, hey. Just focus on my stuff. Thank you. That's nuts. I know. I saw it not doing it. Yo! Oh, I thought we could keep the rares rolling. Oh yeah. All right. Still though, very cool. Got that blue planeswalker. Or, uh, yeah, planeswalker. Grab that guy up real quick. Look at this thumb. Bam. Oh, bam. A little better now that my face isn't in the way. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. No, focus is crazy, man. If I'm not paying, like, absolute attention, it'll just go right out of focus. Oh, yeah, the blue dog. I didn't even see him until you posted that up. And I, I'm like, wait, what? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yo, this set is dope. Frost Giant, what's up? Hey, I gotta fight him, actually, on Dark Alliance. I think that's where me and Joe were at. I don't remember. I know Frost Giant's what I have to fight. Um, yo, Mountain. Hey, White Dragon alt art. That actually looks really cool. I really enjoy, like, the... Uh, the snow on there looks really neat. Whoocha! Precipitous drop, zombie ogre, faint death, blue dragon, purple worm, dungeon map, hoarding ogre, happen on a glade, bam! Oh, this will be tough. Grizzilix? Skrillix Illithid Scholar. Man. That's rad. Let's see, uh, let's see what this guy can do. Whenever a creature you control becomes blocked, you may return it to its owner's hand. Whenever one or more creatures you control deal combat damage to a player, draw a card. He'll eat your brain, bro! He will eat your brain. Whatcha? Hey, Pegasus, all art. Holofoil. I really like that. It's only where the monocolor would be. Everywhere else on the card, it's not hollow at all. That's pretty cool. Just do auto. Yeah, that's right, bro. That's my nickname. Auto. Big secret. My camera's on auto right now. Alright, boys. Let's keep going. All right. Alt art, or rather art cards, rather. Double rathers. All right, we got a Swamp, Dijin Windseer, Manticore, Spare Dagger, Basilisk, Red Dragon, Ray of Frost, Null Raven, Orb of Dragonkind. Check it out. What else we got? Yo! Xanathar, Guild Kingpin. That's a Beholder, baby. Right there. At the beginning of your upkeep, choose an opponent. Until the end of turn, that player can't cast spells. You can look at the top card of their library at any time. You may play the top card of their library, and you may spend mana as though it were any color mana to cast spells this way. So, uh, yeah. Shrek, Shrek is love. Hey, plate armor. Swift foot boots. M12? M12. I'm gonna keep that uh, beholder there. That guy's pretty rad. 
It looks like somebody you work with. Owl bear, check him out. He's so cool. Forest, no hunter, no fillstone though. Hey, Prendy, thank you. Hope you're liking it so far. Got a lot of MTG and D and D stuff, so thanks. We got Capel Duel. We got Bullet, uh, Scaled Herbalist, Loathsome Troll. Burning Hands, Chaos Channeler, Targnar, uh, you find some prisoners, Frog Hemoth, the Frog Horror, ah yes, I remember this guy, except I don't, that guy looks rad, he's a uh, 5 mana, Trample Haste, whenever Frog Hemoth deals combat damage to a player, exile up to that many target cards from their graveyard. Put a plus one plus one counter on Frog Hemoth for each creature card exiled this way. You gain one life for each non-creature card exiled this way. So that's pretty rad. It's not bad, uh, not a bad card right there. Thanks for stopping by, Prendy. I, I really appreciate it, man. It's awesome. Uh, Magic Missile. And a regular card. I got this bomb Tiamat card. I'm just telling everybody, I don't care. It's like the best card in the set. I love it. Dragon God, baby. Alright, anyway. Let's smash the rest of these packs open. Just kidding. I would never. I would never. Alrighty. Hey, Beholder Art. Crushing it. I absolutely love it. Alrighty. Iron Golem. Is that a stone? That is not a stone. Neverwinter Dryad. Owlbear. Hill Giant. Iron Golem. Magic Missile. Wizard. Spoils of the hunt. Oh, Flump! Look out! He's a tiny guy. He's pretty rad. Hey! Delina Wild Mage. That's one of James's favorite cards. Uh, because of the 15 through 20, you create one of these tokens and roll again, so you can technically infinite combo into there. The Flump, baby. No, he's, he's cool. 0-4, Defender Flying. Whenever he's dealt damage, everybody draws. So as long as you don't kill him, he's pretty cool. Oh, Wild Shape. That's pretty cool. And Spoderman, again. Well, guys, it's looking like Tiamat is crushing it. I wanted, I wanted to pull out... Uh, you know, something that could beat it, but I think that's the best card in the set. And I got the Minion of the Mighty. I got my two Phil Stone card. What a solid pull, you guys. Thanks for being here with me. I appreciate it. What do we got here? Hey, it's that Planeswalker. That's the dog art. Doug. Alright, we got an island. Goblin Javelier. Javel. Javelinier? Yeah. Find the Path. Clever Conjurer. Air Cult Elemental. Sudden Insight. Gretchen Twitch Hollow. Druid. Potion of Healing. Air Cult Elemental. The Black Staff of Waterdeep. That's the rare. Um, Borrowing Clan of Undeer. Um. And secret lair, treasure token. Alright, alright. Come on, guys. We're gonna get something. Waterdeep is pretty rad. I just wish that the item itself was pretty rad. The staff of Waterdeep, not as rad. But, pretty cool. 
Purple Worm. I haven't seen a lot of him today. Old alt art and regular art. So let's get rolling. We got a forest. Hey! There's those module lands I was telling you guys about. We got a Frost Giant. Shocking Grass. Bull Strength. Wild Shape. Oh, you guys want me to go back to the Evolving Wilds? Uh, Displacer Beast. I do love those mod lands, man. I'll go back to it real quick afterwards. Uh, Ingenious Smith. Oh! Alright, I guess I don't have to go back because uh, I just got a rare one. Check that out. The Den of the Bugbear. A 17 through 20 adventure. Yo. That is dope. Wow. Cool, man. We got some rad cards going on in here. Wow. The art is insane. Oh, two top loaders stuck together. Man. Den of the Bugbear Land. Let's Joe, baby! They do look like old AD&D books. 100%. That's nice. That's a nice card. Well, good. See, I was telling you guys I wanted to show you something else. And, uh, we got something else! It's freaking sweet. Let's Joe emote for subscribers. Yeah, they said that they ripped the art right off of the manuals. Um, well, what do we got left, guys? Four packs. Oh my god, you guys, I'm tearing into it. I thought this would take me forever. But uh, I'm flipping through pretty quick, I guess. Bullet. Look at that. Look at that. He just wants to eat dirt. That's all he wants to do. He's just eating dirt. Alright, anyway. A swamp. Uh borrow in. Is that a stone? No stone. That's okay. See a guard approach. Kick in the door. Uh find the villain's lair. Recruits painter. Skullport merchant. Prosperous Innkeep, Spletcher Ghoul, Druid, Triumphant, Adventurer, Black White, Death Touch, it's a 1-1, as long as it's your turn, Triumphant Adventurer has First Strike, whenever he attacks, venture into the dungeon, it's not bad, hell yeah, oh, look at that, Holofoil Ranger class, rare, right there, nice little double pull on that, I am flipping through pretty quick, Mimic? Oh, you did. The Mimic match. What is... Huh. Oh, it's like little booster games with two packs you can play in ten minutes. That's pretty cool. I did tear through them pretty, pretty fast, I'm not gonna lie. What's what? What did I miss? Uh oh. It's what, Joe? Oh, the mimic? Oh, it, it's like, uh. So they have like little mini games that they do. So you can do, you know, match and collect the most treasure chests before someone uncovers the mimic. So you get a bunch of tokens out. You put it in a 4x4 four four grid with 16 cards. And then, you know, you play like Guess Who with your cards until, uh,. You know, you find the Mimic. So. It's pretty neat. They have little side games going on in here. It's really neat. I, I love, love this set. Alright. We got some more art, baby. Yeah, it looks cool. I like all the birds. Are those birds? 
No, those are pixies, I think, behind him. I don't know. I'm just going to go with pixies. Maybe burbs. I don't know. Plains. Uh, dire wolf. Minimus containment. Herald of Hadar. Dawnbringer cleric. You meet in a tavern. Grim wanderer. Lar Pashar. Paladin shield. Cave of the frost dragon rare. Pixie burbs. That'd be cool. Uh, there's another duel. If you control two or more, it comes into play tapped, which normally they just come into play tapped all the time. Oh shit. Just kidding, man. How's that for the angle? I'm better. Um, but normally they just always come into play tapped, but these are like beginner lands. Um, if you can play these out quick, you'll uh, they'll come into play untapped. Mind Flare, double rare pull again. Hot, dominate monster. When Mind Flare enters the battlefield, gain control of target creature for as long as Mind Flare's out. Yeah, that sounds about right. He ain't playing around. That's pretty rad. Hey, green dragon. And a raven familiar. That's all she wrote, boys. We got three more packs, man. That was quick. Gonna put a worm in my eye. Oh no. I see what you did there. Let's get some art rolling up in here. Zoop. Hey. Not messing around in the graveyard. Big mind play. Hiya. We got a swamp. Manticore. Priest of ancient lore. Celestial unicorn. Potion of healing. Find some prisoners. Eccentric apprentice. Fly! You fools. Sign of Sturgia. Army veteran. A, a wraith. A wraith. A, a right? Yes. Right enters the battlefield, tap, life drain. Whenever creatures dealt damage by right this turn dies, create a tap 2-2 two, two black zombie creature token and exile that card. All right. He enters tapped, 3-2 two for 2. Ingenious Smith and a dungeon. Okay, boys. If it ain't, if it ain't white, right... Like white? Alright. Let's look at some art. Zoop. Hey, this guy has a little hamster thing. A little hamster. That's pretty cool. What? I know. I said white on this other one. This thing, right? White. Pebbles, the D&D &D hamster. Is that really his name? Mountain. Celestial Unicorn. It is now. Uh, you hear something on watch. This is a Dark Souls card. It's just to be called Light the Bonfire. Uh, Dire Wolf Prowler. Evolving Wilds. Uh, Devil's Chosen. Barbarian Class. Critical hit. Target creature gains double strike until the end of turn. When you roll a natural 20, return crit from your graveyard to your hand. Yo, that's cool. Pebbles the D&D &D hamster is now in all campaigns. Half-elf monk. Drider. Dungeon descent. Enters the battlefield tapped. Tap dead one, four. Tap and untap legendary creature. Venture into the dungeon. Activate only as a sorcery. Bartimo Bar and hamsters. It's a winning combination. Lightning bolt! Those old cards at the end are crazy. Alright guys. This is it. This went way faster than I thought. Just like an hour of content. I need to go slower, is all I'm learning. 
LPM. Hey, wait, I have those gifts. One moment, myself. Bam! Good post, me. That's what I pay money for. Get the good ones. All right, last pack, baby. Take a look at this stalactite art. Where are you going to find stalactite art like this? You're not. You're not. Stalactite art? All right, anyway. Planes. A mimic. Look at that. That guy's cool looking. I love him. Uh, come to a river. Baleful Beholder. Eyes of the Beholder. Guild Thief. Keen-Eared Sentry. Split the Party. Brazen Dwarf. Soul Knife Spy. And a Wizard Spellbook. Let's see anything. Oh, Deadly Dispute. What else? And the Lost Mine of Pandler. Well, holy cow, guys. That was fast. That went way faster than I thought. Oh, I can change over now. Well, I'll, I'll leave it. We'll talk about the cards. So, I know I got at least two. Um, I got my one fill stone. And I got my other fill stone. Do I have any other fill stone? Wow. Three cards from him. That's it. But we did it. Somebody order food? Bam. Let's check them out. So these are the cards I'm going to get signed tomorrow. Um, Phil Stone, like I said, will be a Utica tap room. Um, I'm definitely going to be there. Get these all figured out. Uh, I'm really excited. Yo, what's up, Jazz? How you doing? The best card, though, you guys, this is hollow foil all art. Tiamat, man. This thing... Whew, this thing was a nice open today, guys. I'm really, really happy uh, that I pulled this with you guys. And we all could kind of check it out. These alt arts are so crazy. I wish I could get these cards signed. Uh, the collector packs have better art. Um, there's a lot of more borderless um, art cards like the Tiamat or the Den. Um, man, how wild. What else we got here? Uh, Minion of the Mighty, Old Gnawbone, Elwick, and Morkine. I mean, still though, a lot of rad cards. A lot of rads. And I didn't even put a lot of them in there. I got nervous because my top loader said I only had 25 and I got a lot of rares in the set. Um, but I'll go back through and check it out. Oh, hey. We can open up the, the pink one now. Ka oh, kabam. Pink set. What's up, dudes? That was sweet. Thank you guys so much for showing up, hanging out. Oh. Wish I could show you guys my room. Looks uh, dangerous. It's pink set. I got a couple different overlays that I'm going to be working on. Uh, thanks, man. I appreciate it. Good stream. Pink set. Yeah, my background. Normally it's like a, uh, a yellow and gray. Uh, but I threw this pink one up just to kind of see how it would look. See what you guys thought. Um... But, awesome, man. Well, thank you guys so much for uh, hanging out. Uh, super fun pulls. I had a really good time opening them and sharing some stories. Uh, I'll be on, uh, not with as many card opens, but definitely some Theus Thieves. I got some Project Zomboid stuff that I'm working on, an overlay. Um, but, you know, maybe, maybe a couple more Magic Packs. We'll see. Um, but, yo, thanks for hanging out. Once I get that Discord up, I'll post it. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much. Uh, I'm going to get out of here.
Deuces.